Hi everyone, uh, myself Dr. Naginda Thalor, Intervention Cardiologist. Today we will discuss about how to manage cholesterol. So cholesterol is an essential component of uh, cell, uh, tissue and blood vessels. Cholesterol is needed for production of hormone, vitamin D, bile salt, which is used for digestion and absorption of fat. We, our body synthesizes 80 to 80% uh, of cholesterol and remaining cholesterol we take from the diet, which is called dietary cholesterol. So cholesterol is fatty in nature, so it is insoluble in uh, blood, which is watery in nature. So uh, cholesterol is uh, mixed up with protein, which is called lipoprotein. So in the lipoprotein, the inner core is made by uh, lipid and outer part is made by protein. So it became the soluble in blood. So two type of lipoprotein are important. One is LDL, which is called low density lipoprotein or bad cholesterol. LDL take the cholesterol to the blood vessels and cells. And if LDA level is increased in blood, it start to accumulate or deposit in an inner wall of the blood vessels. So blood vessels become thick and hard and they increase the blood pressure and they increase the risk of heart attack and brain stroke. Other is HDL, which is called high density lipoprotein for good cholesterol because it takes the cholesterol from the blood and it take to liver where it utilizes or is excreted out from the body. So H in HDL is stand for healthy. One more uh, lipid or fat is present in the blood, which is we call triglyceride. Triglyceride we get from the diet and body also synthesize triglyceride. If cholesterol level is high in body, usually we have no signs and symptoms and we know it by only by blood test for which we do the lipid profile test. In the lipid profile test, we measure total cholesterol, HDL cholesterol, LDL cholesterol, triglyceride level and VLDL. And we measure in the milligram per deciliter. So desirable range of total cholesterol should be less than 200 and LDL less than 100, HDL more than 60, and triglyceride less than 150 milligram per deciliter. If this uh, cholesterol level is increased above the normal limit, it uh, start to accumulate in the blood vessels and it increase the risk of heart attack and brain stroke. So we need to uh, keep it at low level and if our cholesterol is high, we should take the measures to decrease it in normal range. For this, we uh, can take some medicines or diet modification and lifestyle changes. In the medicines, we use uh, statins, which is most common medicine used in day by day, and they decrease the LDL cholesterol and increase HDL cholesterol. Other are uh, uh, bile acid sequestrants, which also decrease the LDL, and uh, nicotinic acids, which increase HDL, and decrease the LDL. Other are fibric acid derivatives, which are mainly used for to reduce, decrease the triglyceride level, but they also reduce the LDL. And next is cholesterol absorption inhibitors. They also reduce the LDL level. So all these drugs we can use single or in combinations. Besides drug, we use some lifestyle changes. Uh, like we should take healthy eating habits in which uh, the saturated fat we should be take very less. And saturated fat like uh, fatty meat, cheese, and dairy product, processed food, they should be keep minimum. And diet high in the saturated fat, trans fat, salt, or sugar should be keep minimum. These in uh, uh, and diet rich in fiber or fruits or vegetables, we should increase. Fiber rich diet like oatmeal, whole grain, nuts, and beans, we should take. 
and next is exercise if you do daily exercise for 30 minute moderate intensity exercise or 150 minute in week this exercise increase our hdl level reduce ldl level and triglyceride and next is weight reduction if our body weight is uh, more than our uh, height so we reduce the body weight and if we reduce by 10% it definitely uh, reduce our cholesterol and triglyceride level and next is quit smoking or alcohol because both decrease the hda level and increase the risk of heart attack and brain stroke and next we should uh, reduce our stress level because stress also reduce hdl and increase ldl so uh, we should reduce our stress level by yoga meditation and take the proper sleep of 7 to 9 hours which heals and repairs our heart and blood vessels in the last uh, we summarize the talk the cholesterol is a essential component of body tissue and cells and it is one of the major controllable risk factor for heart disease heart attack and brain stroke so if our cholesterol is high we should take proper medicines and dietary modification and lifestyle modification and what our our age every day we should follow steps to keep the cholesterol uh, lower and we should take uh, time to time uh, doctorly advice and regularly check our cholesterol level so you can uh, keep and follow up it thanks to all for watching